those first days in Celieri's bar were slow. I moved crates and delivered messages. The guys busted balls and told stories from the old country. Mostly, we just waited. I got to thinking, maybe life in Celieri's crew wasn't gonna get me clipped. <laughs> what did I know? You, Tommy? Yeah. Boss is waiting for you. Thanks. Oh, he's got a little hat. What's up, Tommy? Need some fucking pants to match that fucking top. Oh, I guess this this doesn't look nice. Look at this bullshit. You need a new coat. That's what you need. There he is. Sorry, I'm late. Take a seat. My bad. That's collection day, boys. So Tommy, you'll drive. Paulie and Sam can handle the rest. It'll be routine. Just give me the fucking stuff. money. Bill at the motel was a short last night. So make sure he pays us the interest he owes. No problem, boss. Don't lay hands on anyone unless there's no other choice. Our clients need to understand that we provide a valuable service. They need to look at you and see Santa Michael. They need to believe the protector. So let Morella stick to breaking legs. We're better than that. But the bills still do, and everyone pays up. We can handle it. I hope it's a gunfire. Give me your shit. We'll okay, smash up your shop. <laughs> you hold his face in the fucking oven. Oh man, that'd be cool. Then he said to say he's got something for you, Tom. That damn first. Probably just wants to tell you some bullshit story about some guy who died 20 years ago. Oh, he's got like a gun or something. He's gonna take this shit. Or a knife. Stick him with the pointy end. Hey, just the guy. What's up, Don? I saw this. And I thought of you. Appreciate that. How nice. Throw away. All right. You ever carry a rat? Shot him at the fair a couple of times. Breaking into someone's face. They don't come. Like Henry Hill. The target over there. Shoot that motherfucker. Now, click, click, click. Bang. Bring all up the walls. Okay. Now show me a reload. I open the chamber and away you go. All right. Nice. Next thing. Next hit. Stick it in your belt. All right. Good cool. to go. And we shoot I'm taking this fucking magazine. Get behind something. And don't shoot yourself. Thanks, Vincenzo. I appreciate it. Hey, hey. Oh, fix it. What's up? It's fixed, yeah. What's up, Vinny? Nice to meet you, Vinny. Appreciate the friendship. He said, hey, hey, for you, you're just Vinny. Alright, so, where am I going? What am I supposed to do? Ralph. Ralph. See, they got a nice coat. Why do I got this bullshit? Oh, this is the cool guy. Ralph, what's up, Ralph? Elbow goes through. Reach inside. <laughs> he said I'm gonna break the fucking window again. He said, no, you son of a bitch. He said, I'll fucking kill you. <laughs> oh shit, I thought he was gonna stab me. <laughs> Cut my brake lines too, like that other fucking guy. Nice, you can just use a sharp object. How cool is that? These old ass cars. Okay, it's easy what I gotta do. Show me what you can do. Are you rolling with me? You guys are, huh? We're the collection agency. Yeah. He said no breaking any legs, so we gotta fuck the shop up or something. You can't start the fucking car. First we got out. He runs away. Street. You know it? Yeah, I know it. Al's late again. Seems so. That's too bad. Where are you at, Al? Oh shit, I went the wrong way, of course. Yeah, bad sense of direction, just like Zoro. Oh shit. I hear you're going in the opposite direction from where you need to be going. Alright. Yeah, get out the way. The fuck you guys talking back. I swear in front of this cop again. 
hopefully I don't get pulled over. First collection, we're gonna beat this guy's ass too. I guess the train will move. <laughs> it's pretty cool. This has one of the most responsive horns in my heart. They get that the fucking way. How cool is that? Alright, here we are. Okay, this is it. Watch what we do today, Tom. When it goes smooth, it's a breeze. When they put up a fight, sometimes you gotta think on your feet. Sure. Just follow my lead. It's the bakery. I wanna get out? Yeah. Alright, let's go. I'll show you how it's done. I'm gonna get in here and smash some shit up. Sam, Holly, how are you? Damn it. Son of a bitch. Give me my bat. I gotta come over here and intimidate this fool. Damn. Obligation to make payments on your loan agreement. Damn. So, 1930. Oh shit, they said they're, they're taking your fucking. Now he's got any trouble around here? He's got no money. I can't take the money. No? Yeah. No. We're still here to collect. Like Good. So you got the money. I got it uh, waiting in the back room. I'll. Tommy will get it. You stay here where we can see you. It's been real slow this month, Sam. I was worried that we'd be Al, Al. I know you never hold out on us, but it's good you work. Where's the money? She's gonna shoot me at that. She's gonna pull out a gun right now. That shit was gonna blow his fucking head off. I got it. I'll see you next month, Al. Let us know if you need anything. Anything at all. Sure will, sir. Sure will. And give our best to my Dude, I didn't do anything, alright. Let's roll. Okay, next up we got all your jeans place. China store up on Tallow. Yeah, it's a good thing I waited for the GPS. I was gonna turn right. His nephew's taking over. The second place. His name is not Eugene. Guy's a Chinaman. But it sounds like you, Jim. Well, that's what we called him. Polly slammed his head into the counter back in, what, 27, I think? <laughs> yeah, it was hilarious. That's fucked up. After that, no problems at all. But if you look, you can still see the blood. Poor old bastard <laughs> couldn't spell That's it fucked out. up. We keep some of these guys on our books to remind the Chinatown gangs they're in our city, not theirs. But we don't know you <laughs> Damn. Crash, you make little Rafi cry. <laughs> he says, fuck, I gotta fix that. We don't know Eugene's nephew, so he might need reminded, though. He says we might need to throw him in the fucking oven. Deep fry his non-cooking hand or something. We'll see. I'll cover this one, Sam. You sure? Sure, I'm sure. Let me out. I got it. Come on, me too. He's doing the store on his own. Yeah, when Polly's built up a little steam and he's to let it out on his own. She gotta let him get on with it. It's his way. You can hear it in his voice. Gotta let him lone wolf from time to time. What if they turn out the fucking window? <laughs> All these big dudes come up, that'd be funny. Yeah, Eugene's nephew ain't having much fun right now. When he's going, Polly don't stop. Once we were putting a squeeze on his tailor over in Holbrook, guy ended up in a wheelchair. Damn. <laughs> this guy's just sweeping while they fucked the fucking restaurant up. 
Oh man, that's funny, or whatever that little store is. Here he comes. He's a fast worker. Drive before the cop show, Tom. Next stop's Bill at the motel. Eugene's nephew's guy's money is ours next week, with some extra besides. You doing okay? He's okay. How's the shop counter? Yeah, that's seen some more blood. How much blood? And nothing he can't scrub out. Once he's back on his feet. You wanna come out with us again, Tom? Get to hear even more about Chinese nephew guys scrubbing their own blood out of shop counters. Yeah, seems like it's not too hard. Not hard. Kinda not hard. I don't know. Comes natural to you guys. Don't see why it can't come natural to me. So anyone could do this. Me and Polly, we've been working these streets for years. You come in and you think you know it all? I'm not saying that, Sam. I... You've been a day on the job, pal. You haven't seen what we do. You haven't seen how we do it. Sam, I think you ought to... No, Polly. This punk thinks he can walk in here like a big shot. I put greasers like him in the ground. I think you gotta say you're sorry, Tom. Sorry, huh? Well, I'd say sorry if I couldn't see the bullshit smile you're trying to hide. <laughs> you got him, though, Sam! You got him! <laughs> I can try to break his boss. in your pants from here. Nah, you didn't get that. <clears throat> oh, Ralphie's just gonna love you. Nah, you didn't get me. Talk <laughs> <laughs> When he first came out with us, I had him on his knees before he knew I was yanking his chain. <laughs> yeah, you did better than him anyways. Damn, that's fucked up. He said I fucking had him like a little bitch. Jesus. I hate it out of the city. You hate it most places. Yeah, but out here it's worse. How come there's a place so far out of town on our books? Oh, out of town's shit. the safest place for deals. The safest place for card games. The safest place yep. for most of the things we build. We're expecting a big bag of money today. The guy owes. If it ain't big, the boss will be pissed. Yeah, this place is a real earner. Oftentimes the places that get you the most dough are the ones most people don't look at twice. Each time you crash, you make little Ralphie cry. Shit, I thought I had enough speed and they're probably get yeah, this fucked up with that rock. Learner. Oftentimes the places that get you the most dough are the ones most people don't look at twice. Just recently the motels had a new lease of life. Last stop before I lost heaven for rum coming up from Cuba. They drive it this far. Sure they do. And Don't. that's how we can sell it so expensive. Bill's Motel has gotten to be the place where crates get exchanged. Salieri protects it, but he lets the other families use it too. Even Morello? To keep the peace? Sure. Plus it's far enough away that no one cares. So long as everyone's making money, no one's gonna rock the boat. He's like, everyone's happy for me. Everyone else starting to miss the side of the streets and sidewalks. You got one for the great outdoors. Since we're in the middle of fucking nowhere. For anything. Indoors, outdoors, in the city, out of the city. I hate it out here. Like when we sit in the field doing some booze handover or something. It's always knee deep in shit and most times it's dark and cold as hell. Okay, there it is. Finally. This fucking motel. For us here, Tom. Damn it. Back in a bit. Okay. I was going to fuck someone up, too. He said, fuck all that. Oh, the cops are going to come or something, huh? Tell Salieri from here on out this place is ours. Capish? Don't come back. Or you'll end up in worse shape than your friends. Get Phil. They're trying to get information out. I gotta get you to a doctor. Uh, I can wait. Get Sam out of there. Okay. Okay, just hang on. Damn. Alright, that's just what I wanted. Not for them to get shot, but for some people to fuck up. Oh, I can climb up right there too. Must have left it at home. 
Yeah. Alright, so you're dead. So I guess I could try this way. Choose death with the gun. That bastard. Taking the shit. It's like John Travolta. Johnny Travolta he got his fucking ass kicked in the bathroom taking the shit. Something shotgun is for. Oh god, I'm just be waiting and shit. Look, I'm a fucking pistol. Go up, motherfucker. Where you at? See this? Oh shit. Motherfucker. Come on, come back out. Yeah, yeah, motherfucker. Mm, there you go. That's everyone. They're all dead. It was very violent, so I used the shotgun. What a nice scene for the boss to find. Sam, they really went to work on you, buddy. Uh, come on, you'll be all right. You're tough as nails. Oh, oh shit. You can just see me kill like these other five people you listen to. Oh, he's got the money. Why would he do that? Why didn't he just leave? Why would he attack in the room? Where is Sam? He's okay. Inside. Go get the money. That's where I'm going, buddy. Cause both of you guys fucked up. So much for that. I've been doing this for years. Bullshit. All right. So I'm gonna get the fucking money then. Let's go. This fucking car going any faster than 60 miles an hour? Help, I'm hitting the fucking car with these shots at least. I don't think I was. Hell yeah.
on, let's hit this fucking guy too. Oh, I made it past the turn of death. Shoot that fucking car. It's pretty good at reloading and driving. You know, this is like a six shooter. It's not like it's got fucking clips to toss in and out. Oh, yeah, come on. Shoot. Oh, fucking guy. How's that? You want some more? Are you dead? That was when I saw the car. What it meant to be on the inside. Fuck. I should have took off there and then. But I couldn't go back to being a nobody. He said, no, the money was pretty cool. Damn. Yeah.